Hey guys, Thad Tanner here from Pioneer Doors. Welcome back to another episode. And I'm gonna be showing you the next big thing. Here it is. The brand new Monster Bass subscription box. I am so excited to be working with this brand new subscription box company. Today, I'm gonna be unboxing this and showing you guys everything that came in your monthly box in the month of May. Now, the thing, the unique thing about Monster Bass that's so much different from all the other subscription boxes is it's a regional company. Now, what I mean by regional is each bait is handpicked for each region specifically. So, everybody that got their box down in Florida may be getting completely different baits from everybody up here in the Great Lakes region like myself is you're not just gonna be throwing random baits that you would never throw during the pre-spawn here in the Great Lakes region that you would be throwing out in California. So it's all completely different each region and that's why people don't really like doing these subscription boxes is because they just get baits that don't ever work for the time of year and some of them are just complete crap. Here with Monster Bass, Monster Bass will send you the best baits and the best baits for that time of year in your region. So we're gonna break this thing open. And first thing is, I love the look of this box. Gives you a little chance to win prizes here. Take a picture of your catch or the items in the box and hashtag it the better box. Share it on your social media like Instagram, Facebook, any of those and hashtag it monster bass and then you can have a chance to win prizes every single week. That really get, catches people attention. And right from the start, we open up the box and we get a bait card showing you every single bait that comes in the box. And then on the back, you get a thank you letter straight from the, straight from the owner, Rick Patry. He just wants to personally thank all of us for getting the box. And that really shows how much he appreciates every single customer. First off, we got a deep diving chartreuse crankbait from Live Target, the Bait Ball series. Basically what this is, it's, it's, is it's multiple bait fish all paired into one crankbait itself. So basically it's like a school of fish. Um, this will be really, really good during the pre-spawn here up in the Great Lakes region. And now this is a 5 8 ounce bait and it dives about 12 feet deep. So there's the Live Target Deep Diving Bait Ball Series Crankbait. Next, we got the OG Original Bill Lewis Rattle Trap. Now this rattle trap is a half ounce, half ounce bait in a war mouth color. That will be super, super good. Throwing that on those ledges and those grass spots this time of year. Next up, we got a good old Booyah spinnerbait in that chartreuse and white color with that double willow blade. This bait is a three ounce, three eighths ounce and that'll be a killer this time of year and really through the rest of the year. I'll throw a spinnerbait in the spring, summer, and fall. Spinnerbait is a fish catching machine. Next up we got the Strike King Rage Tails. It is a four inch bait in that green pumpkin color. That's very one out here for you guys. I love throwing a green pumpkin rage tail like this on a Texas rig or even on even on a jig used as a trailer. And I love throwing this during the spawn for those spawning bass up on beds. And it even works here in the pre-spawn. So it's a good go-to bait. And I'll use that in every pretty much all through the year. I'll use this through the spring, summer, and fall also. So that is a very versatile bait. We got a Doomsday Sea Shad. This bait is a three inch bait, and I'll pull it out here for you. Basically looks like a little shad. And I'll probably throw this on either a drop shot or even a jig head. And I haven't really decided anything else, but I know that people throw this on like a drop shot and all that stuff. So, so there's that for you. 
That looks like a super good bait. I'm pretty sure that would be awesome. Out in the bay with Benjamin, throwing a drop shot for those big Lake Huron smallmouth. Next product in the box is some Daiichi 4 aught Wacky Rig Hooks. So we'll be using those quite a bit because I like to throw a Wacky Rig quite a bit this time of year. And also, a big co to a mine that I'm super excited about that I haven't tried specifically, but I have thrown this bait, is the Ned Rig. Now I've thrown the Ned Rig itself, but I've never thrown TRD ticklers around. I've just thrown the normal, like, normal TRD, um, I can't remember the name, just the normal stick bait, but it almost reminds me of like a little tube almost. Pair that up on these one tenth ounce shroom heads here. So that'll be awesome when I go in these little cricks fishing for big smallmouth this summer and even this spring. The last package of bait that I am honestly, these are, these are so cool and I will be throwing these quite a bit is these creature beaver tail looking baits by Smart Baits. And the cool thing about it is they change colors. So I'll pull a bait out for you here. But I got it just in that little black and red craw color with a little hint of red and a little hint of gray there. But I'm gonna be showing you guys a little a little example of how these things legitimately change colors. Here it is. So guys, talking about the smart baits and show you that the color changing is actually legit. So, so what I got here is a glass of warm water and a glass of cold water. And we're gonna do a little bit of a test. And it's actually really cool. I actually checked it out earlier and it's super cool. We're gonna throw it in cold water first. We're gonna let that change a little bit. And we're gonna put this one in the warm water. Let that change a little bit. We'll give it a few minutes here. So here is here is the legit bait here. It's um color of black and red, with a little hint of gray on the end of the tail there. And uh, so that's like the legit color. Now I'll pull out the one from the cold water. And as you can see, this one definitely when it hits that colder water, it'll turn into more of a reddish craw color and get rid of more of those blacks and just go more of the, the red craw. Now, the one, the warm water had an extreme change. In that warm water, it uh, changed into more of a natural green, green pumpkin watermelon kind of color. A little bit of hint of gray, a little bit of black, and quite a bit of green really shows you that in the warmer warmer seasons when the water's warmer a more natural color so like your green pumpkins your watermelons that more reddish craw color is a lot better in that colder pre-spawn spawning water this might not be showing you all the different colors this bait can change into because this is straight hot water and that's straight cold water cold water so you get some water temps in between those two, it might change into like a more grayer color or even a chartreuse color. On the back of the bag here, it shows it can turn into like a little bit of red, pink, your natural colors, and even some chartreuse colors. So you have no reason to buy all kinds of different colors because with just this one package of smart baits and you can cover the whole year from all the way from pre-spawn to post-spawn fishing 
and you can get all these different colors. So that is everything in the box, guys. That, that, that. amazing first box from Monster Bass. Even comes with a super, super cool sticker and I'm still trying to decide what I want to put that on. And also a $10 promo code that you guys can go to the site and get your box $10 off if you type in this promo code at the checkout. That is all I have for today guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed my first ever Monster Bass subscription box unboxing video. And trust me, there will be more. And I'm also going to be doing a little challenge video with the Monster Bass box. I plan on doing like a Monster Bass challenge where I'm going to take every bait, take them to the lake, and catch a fish on every single bait in this box. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. And make sure to always keep on keeping it real. We will see you in the next episode. Peace.